Hi there. The intended learning outcome of this video is for students and consumers to be able to compare the different health insurance marketplace plans and decide which one is the most fitting for their needs. The health insurance marketplace, also known as health insurance exchange or the exchange, is a governmental website, a federal website, where consumers in the United States can purchase private health insurance plans individually or as family and receive income based subsidies if eligible to reduce the cost of health insurance. In this video we will compare the four types of marketplace health insurance plans. The bronze plan the silver, the gold, and the platinum plan. We will compare these plans according to the premium, deductibles, out-of-pocket payments, coverage levels, and the monthly average premium in 2022. First, the premium. The premium is the amount the consumers pay for their health insurance every month. This is the amount to be paid every month directly to the health insurance company. For any of these plans, the monthly premium will be determined based on several factors including uh, enrollee age, smoking status. Some states require smokers to pay a surcharge for smoking. Residents, some states are more expensive than others, and certain counties are more expensive than others. The number of people enrolled in the plan and the insurance company itself. Certain insurance companies are more expensive than others. Bronze plants have the lowest monthly premium. Conversely, the platinum plants are on the other side of the premium continuum with the highest monthly premiums. Silver and gold plans are somewhere between. Deductibles. What do we mean by deductibles? Deductibles, or the deductible, is the amount the consumers pay for covered health care services before the insurance plan starts to pay. With a $2,000 deductible, for example, the consumer pays the first $2,000 of covered services. After the consumers pay their deductible, they usually pay only a co-payment or co-insurance for the covered services the insurance company pays the rest. Note that all these plans pay the full cost of certain preventive benefits even before paying the deductible. And note that some plans have separate deductibles for certain services like prescription drugs. 
Family plans often have both an individual deductible, which applies to each person, and a family deductible, which applies to all family members. Generally, plans with lower monthly premiums have higher deductibles. Plans with higher monthly premiums usually have lower deductibles. Third, out-of-pocket out payments. Out-of-pocket payments are the expenses of healthcare that are not covered by insurance plan and that the consumer needs to pay to pay out-of-pocket. The out-of-pocket expenses include deductibles, coinsurance, copays, and any service that are not covered by the health plan. Plans with lower premiums usually have the highest out of patient, out of pocket payment. And the plans with the, this is like the PROMS plan. And the plans with the highest premium, like the platinum plan, has the lowest out of pocket payments. Coverage level. On average, these plans cover anywhere between 60% of the total cost for a bronze plan to 90% for a platinum plan, and release pay the rest of the total cost. Health insurance premiums vary widely across the U.S as we will show later. However, for an individual, the average monthly premium is 329 US dollars for a PROMS plan, 428 US dollars for a silver plan, and 462 dollars for a gold plan. No matter which plan the consumer chooses, bronze, silver, gold, or platinum, the same set of essential health benefits will be covered. And these are addiction treatments, ambulatory services, birth control, breastfeeding, care for newborns and children, emergency services, hospitalizations, laboratory services, maternity care, mental health services, occupational and physical therapy, prescription drugs, preventive and wellness services. So regardless which plan you choose, these services will be included at minimum. Choosing the right plan can be a challenge. Consumers should consider their health status and their financial situation in making this risk, when making this decision. In general, if the consumer expects to have many health care visits or require regular, regular prescriptions, they may be better off with a gold or a platinum plan that pays a higher percentage of the cost. If, on the other hand, consumer and family are healthy and don't expect to have many healthcare related bills, they might be better off choosing a bronze or silver plan. This graph and the two that will follow show the average lowest cost monthly premium for a 40-year-old individual for the year 2022. This one is for the PROMS plan. So you can see, for example, that uh, in Nebraska, the average 
lowest cost premium for a bronze plan is four hundred forty six dollars. West Virginia would have the highest with six hundred twenty one. And this one shows the same average for silver plans in twenty twenty two. Uh, look at Connecticut. This average is for five hundred forty dollars. Five hundred ninety one for Nebraska. Iowa four hundred eighty. And this one is for the gold plan. Uh, Seven hundred twenty four for New York. Connecticut is at 511. You can freeze this or pause this video and look for your state. Should you have any questions, please leave them in the comments below. Thank you.